Welcome to another episode of The Love Hub, where we give tips and advices to women about love and relationships. This episode is about things to say to your boyfriend to make him laugh. A quick shout out to A.H. Didra and Janine Akra. Thank you so much for watching our channel. For topic requests and shout out requests, please like, subscribe, and comment down below. Tip number one, be silly. Some girls aren't great at slaying a crowd in one-liners and well-timed anecdotes. To play up your humor, the simplest and most effective way is to just be silly. It shows you're happy, fun, and that you don't take life too seriously. Go for the physical humor. Make funny faces, pretend you're stuck with slow motion, hop on him for a piggyback ride, or start a well-meaning food fight. Put on a show. Do a foreign accent or pretend you're him. It's like lightly mocking him as a form of flirting. Or you can also try to react to him in silly ways. That is tip number one, be silly. Tip number two, always be yourself. There is nothing better than someone who is truly genuine and comfortable with themselves. If you can be you, you're showing him that he can be him with nothing to worry about. The humor will come naturally when you're both happy and relaxed. Don't worry about being funny enough for him. If you're lighthearted and enjoy having fun, he'll enjoy having fun with you. Don't worry about the impression you're making. Do what it makes to make you happy, and he'll probably want to join in. If you're trying to be funny, it'll come across that you're trying to be funny. Always be natural, and let the conversation flow naturally. The humor will come. Tip number two. Be yourself. Tip number three, always be positive. We live often, crave being around people who are bright and cheery because it's contagious. They make us bright and cheery, bringing out the side of us that we feel confident about. When we're optimistic, everything is a bit brighter. When everything is a bit brighter, it's easy to crack jokes and to crack a smile in return. It's easier to take a mundane situation and turn it into an opportunity to have fun. The more fun you have, the more you and him will be laughing. That is tip number three, always be positive. Tip number four, get to know him. Humor is subjective. What you find funny won't necessarily be the same. Even your best friend finds funny. So, in order to know what tickles his funny bone, you get to know him better. What TV shows does he like? What comedians? What kind of humor does he use to amuse others? All of these are cues as to what gets him giggling. The most aptly timed joke won't be appreciated by the type of guy who prefers laughing at toilet humor. And it works the other way around too. That is tip number four. Get to know him better. Tip number five, learn to laugh at his jokes. On the whole, women value a sense of humor more than men do. What do men want? Someone who will make them feel funny. Instead of trying to impress him, show him that he impresses you. Showing him that he has the right to laugh at his own jokes because he's just so awesome. You don't have to laugh at every joke that he makes, like your world has just been altered. If he drops a dude, laugh at him, playfully, and he just try an unfunny, stereotypical, sexist, blonde joke, let him know how cute he is for trying to fake a chuckle and a forced grin. That is tip number five, learn to laugh at his jokes. Tip number six. Learn to feed off his humor. When we click with people, chemistry is pretty unable to ignore. To show him that you just get him and that you appreciate his humor, you need to learn to feed off it. Establishing a banter 
that can develop a rapport between the two of you, creating a bond that will easily be broken. Whether his humor is self-deprecating or straight out of Family Guy, you go with the flow. Show him that you appreciate how fun he is. That is tip number six, feed off his humor. Tip number seven, help him be happy in general. When life is bleak, we're not going to laugh no matter what. To see the humorous side of things, we have to be willing. To work on helping him to be happy. Making someone happy is impossible. They have to want it too. By being your awesome self and gracing his presence with it. By being positive and fun. You're really doing all that you can. Learn to be his friend or whatever is fitting for your relationship. You do little things for him and just try to make his life easier, especially if he's been dealt or a sour deck of cards. Let him see the bright side of life so the humor can start flowing. That is tip number seven. Help him be happy in general. Tip number eight. Be willing to embarrass yourself. There are a few things funnier and mood uplifting than a person that can embarrass themselves and just roll with it. There are a few things worse than a person that embarrasses themselves and gets all self-conscious and shameful. So when you spill that soda on yourself, just say that you're saving it for later and that brown looks better on you than white anyway. Studies actually show that embarrassing yourself can actually get people to like you and trust you more. It sort of makes sense when you show you're down to earth, light-hearted, and just a plain human like they are. It takes away any possible intimidation and stress. That is tip number eight, be willing to embarrass yourself. Thank you so much for watching. For topic requests and shout out requests, please like, subscribe, and comment down below.